And these two handbags are incredibly special to me personally and the brand. This is the lunchbox actually owned by Elizabeth Taylor and purchased back by me at the Christie's auction of Elizabeth Taylor's possessions. And it was the very first handbag of the brand. And it is very sculptural, very architectural, and very practical form and function. So, and it has a shoulder strap in addition, and you can really wear it to everything except very formal, and it comes in three sizes. And this particular one here was um, recruited by Princess Diana for me to design for her in her name. It is the Princess Diana handbag, again, very architectural. When she first saw it after a year of me designing it and coming up with something that was completely different than anything that existed, she said, oh, it's tall and slim, just like me. And that was her stamp of approval. And it was so sweet and so lovely, and it, I felt so good at the time. It's very good because it has a contour front, level of difficulty in production 10, very difficult. Factory owner in Italy has to cut this contour. It's piped with three millimeter piping on the contour and on the three side gussets. And it packs flat in a suitcase. So it's, it's wonderful for travel. Again, it has several shoulder straps that you can interchange. And it is, it's elegant, it's classic, it's elegant, it's regal, it's form and function again. It has many pockets inside for all the modern conveniences of today's times. And um, we do it in 150 colors also in alligator and ostrich. And uh, we've done some extraordinary pieces. We also have a diamond heart limited edition Princess Diana, which uh, one will be available in the store in Palm Beach. It'll be the only one in the United States. And so these two are very, very dear to my heart, in addition to the Cleopatra clutch of the Oscars.